Hi all. It's been quite a long time without a video, so I thought I'd best um, put something together to show you what I'm up to. Um, this is what I've been working on today. It's obviously the door with the name rings. Um, you haven't seen me unbox this yet, but I'll put the unboxing in a bit later in the video. Um, and then you could see all that stuff coming out, but I've actually done quite a bit of work on it. Well, it's all painting mostly. Um, <clears throat> Other than that, not really many big jobs done, it's just lots of little ones. So, I'll show you all the bits and bobs. So over here I've got one of the horn plates. Now this had a couple of extra holes in, so I've just had to fill those in. And I've ground them back so this is ready for priming again. Um, next to that I've got the spec plates. They're painted on the other side, but this is first top coat on this side. Um, having a bit of trouble getting a nice finish with the brush paint so well it's not too bad but there's a lot of brush marks in it as I say it's only the first coat though so I can put a couple more on I've got the tender over here which is fully undercoated on the outside now so that's two coats of primer three coats of undercoat that needs obviously needs a top coat but I'm still trying to work out whether I'm going to brush it or spray it, so it's just been sitting there at the moment. Uh, the inside's still bare steel, hasn't been primed or anything yet. So over here we've got the rack of bits in various states of painting. This is obviously the first front wheel which was done ages ago, and the second wheel I've been putting off doing, but I need to start that soon. It's the bunker extension. A few bits and bobs there. Those are in final undercoat, but obviously you need top coat. There's another horn plate there. Um, that's the remains of the smoke box kit. This is obviously the smoke box, which I've just been painting today as well. I've been using this um, plastic coat stuff. Been really pleased with that. I think a few other builders on the forum use that as well, so that's where it's recommended. But you just spray it on, leave it for a couple of hours and then bake it in the oven. It seems to get a really nice finish. So I've done the smoke box and the doors in that as well. This is kit number three, which I was expecting to be the smoke box and the chimney, but I'm pretty sure there's not only a chimney in here. So we'll see. chimney cap and not supply. Okay, let's see what we've got. There's a small name ring in there. Chimney base ring. Hinge. Chimney base casting. I'll open all this up in a bit so you can see what's what. Baffle plate. Name ring. There's the door. There's the actual smoke box. Yep. So 
So yeah, quite pleased with how this has come out. That's again, that's that plastic stuff. The barbecue paint. Now I seem to have done the majority of all the jobs that aren't painting, so there's pretty much only painting left to do at the moment until some more kits arrive, or at least painting some of the bits is stopping me from progressing. So I might look at getting a spray gun and trying that out, see how that goes. Okay, see you next time with another unboxing. I think the rear wheels are due soon, so we'll have a look at those. Bye.